Hello, it's Ruby and today I'm going to be showing you an updated school morning routine. So I usually get up at around 6 in the morning and then the first thing I will do is just do some gentle stretches and I do these arm exercises which are supposed to strengthen your arms. And then I will go straight to the bathroom and I will open up the shutters. And then I decided to put on my bed jacket because it was really cold. So then I brush my teeth and I am using this new toothbrush which is from the company Liabo and it has three different settings so you can clean, whiten and then massage your gums. As someone who loves dental hygiene I'm really enjoying this toothbrush so far. And at the same time as brushing my teeth, of course I was reading, and at the moment I am reading Why Be Happy When You Can Be Normal, which is by Jeanette Winderson, who also writes Oranges Are Not The Only Fruit. So then I decided to fill up my jug, which is from the wash basin that I keep in my bedroom, and using this I just washed my face. And then I got changed into the clothes that I'd be wearing for school and I'm just wearing a normal skirt and shirt today and then I went and opened up my curtains and as you can see it was starting to get light by this time and as I do really every morning regardless of the time of year I opened up my window and I just like to let in some fresh air So then next I go and make my bed and since I have an echo dot I will also listen to my flash news briefing at the same time. And this morning I also sorted through the soft toys that I kept on my bed um, because I had quite a few behind my pillows and I didn't really want all of them anymore. That's all from your flash briefing. You are listening to a program from BBC Radio 4. This is another thing that I will listen to every morning and it basically provides a religious thought of the day and they're only about two to four minutes. And then I went and put on my tie and also this really lovely v-neck jumper. And then I brushed out my hair and I just took one single piece of hair and I plaited this so I could feed it into my ponytail. This is my favourite way to wear my hair to school because it keeps my hair off my face and I think it looks fairly smart. And then next I decided to curl my fringe. This just makes it look a lot neater. Then next I went downstairs and I made myself some porridge for breakfast and I just put in some coconut flakes because I really love the way that it makes the porridge taste. And then I went to the cupboard to go and get some tea and also a mug. And the tea that I'm using today was actually sent to me by The Match Reserve, which is my favourite tea company. This is one of their new superfood teas and it gives you loads of energy. And actually, having used it for the last few days, I have found that I've had a lot more energy in the mornings. I would honestly recommend this. It's called the I'm So Excited Tea. And then I just topped it up with some cold water and I love this mug as well it looks like a toadstool so then I just chopped up some banana and put on some almond butter as well into my porridge and at the same time as reading breakfast as you know I do every morning I read and again I am reading the Jeanette Winterson book so then I scrape my leftovers into this bowl to give to the chickens and then I wash up my plate and my bowl and also the pot that I made the porridge in. 
Then after that, I decide to go up to my room to do some homework. This is something that I've actually only recently started doing. I didn't used to revise in the mornings before school, but from around 6.45 slash 7, I will do some work and I start off by doing some chemistry work. So at the moment, I am doing a chemistry quizlet. And I also decided to light a candle and drink some of my amazing tea. So most mornings I will do one or two pages of chemistry questions, but this morning I knew that I needed to make this quizlet, so I decided it would be the most productive use of my time. And this took me about half an hour. Then after that I did a timed English essay paragraph, which is again something that I do every morning. I just like to be able to keep into the essay writing mode so that it's easier to write them when I go into exams and I'm used to the structure. So I put on a timer for six minutes but I ended up overstepping this quite a lot. I think I ended up writing these essay paragraphs for about 15 minutes but my camera did run out of charge halfway through so you only see me doing 10 minutes. Then after that I decided to go outside. I like to go outside at least a little bit every morning because it's good to get some fresh air. And I put on my favourite coat which I actually wore in my last morning routine. And as you can see we have had some snow recently which is so beautiful. I think everyone just loves the way that snow looks. So then when I got back inside I put on some lip scrub and then also this sugar rose lip balm from Fresh and this eye cream from Fresh again. Then I went and read my daily quote of the day from my 365 Days of Wonder book. For kindness begets the kindness evermore which is Sophocles. So then I do my last minute tidy of my bedroom and I go and choose a magazine to bring to school because I like to bring one to school every morning. And then I will get ready for school, so just put on my blazer and also my prefect gown, which you'll know about if you've watched mine and Jade's video on head girls. And then I'm off to school. So thank you so much for watching this video. I hope that you enjoyed and have a productive week.